Okay, guys, lesson four was all about or is all about links. And as you've learned in this lesson, links are one of the backbones of the Internet. They are super important. It's what makes the Internet um, a big part of what it is. It helps us make content interactive. It helps us link web pages together. And without links, we'd really have a lot of trouble surfing the web and moving around. So links are really important for navigation and for connecting things together. In this exercise, we're going to practice making Making hyperlinks and what we're doing is we are turning a set of text or lines of text into links that go to specific web pages so we want to use these URLs and we're going to turn this text here into links to these URLs okay we're going to use the a tag that we just learned about as well as the href attribute when we run the code we can see that Right now, it is set up as links because each line of text is surrounded in an anchor tag or a tag, but it's not going anywhere. The href attribute is blank. So in the first line, we want the CodeHS homepage text to link to CodeHS.com. So I'm just going to copy that, Control-C to copy, and Control-V to paste it into the href attribute. Okay, you can think of attributes as additional information that you can give a tag. I believe this is the first attribute that we're covering. And in this case, this attribute tells the anchor tag which website we're trying to get to or which URL we're trying to target. Okay, so we can test that by clicking on CodeHS homepage and it should take us to CodeHS.com. All right, so looks like this link is working. Very good if you got this. And what you're going to do next is turn CodeHS Sandbox into a link to the Sandbox editor. And then finally, the courses, my courses on CodeHS to CodeHS.com slash my courses. Okay, so we can use that control C, control V to copy and paste if you don't want to type all of that out. All right, guys, good luck with this.